Hello, I'm T1 Glisteralf, Jigglypuff Maine from Northeast Georgia, and I'm going to show you how to beat every single target test stage with Jigglypuff. We're going to start off with a little bit of discussion first. The reason that most characters can't complete every target test stage is because there are really just two bottleneck stages. Young Link's and Jigglypuff's. Now, I think it's safe to say that Young Link can beat his own stage and Jigglypuff can beat its own stage. So, when, I'm not even going to bother going over Puffs, but Young Link's is really where it's at. So, as you can see on here, we are starting off with Young Link's stage. This is 20XX version 4.06. Alright, so, going to melee. Already got it set to my Jigglypuff. Hashtag Eva, because I love you, Evangeline. That's my baby. I uh, have to set it to time. Going single player. I guess you could do this with a friend, but doing it with a CPU that's battling you the whole time is a, a little annoying. Alright, so. It starts you way up in the air. We're going to go down to the bottom for the full proof. Okay. So, in order to get out of this well, one of two things needs to be true. I guess take cut two and a half things need to be true. You either need to be able to wall kick, which is how Young Link gets out, have a ridiculously high vertical recovery, or be Peach, who can just Peach Bomber all the way up. So those characters can get out, and I think there are eight characters that can wall jump and that can get out just through that. So let's see, Fox, Falco, Falcon, Young Link, Pika or Pichu. Oh, Mario. I'm trying to see the list of characters in my head to try to finish it all out. Oh, it's Sheik, but not Zelda. And then there's what? Maybe it is Pikachu. I don't think so, though. I think that there's another one. God, this is gonna bother me. Ah. <laughs> all right. So, how does Jigglypuff get out? Well. You probably already know, and I'm going to cut the volume up a little bit because there's an audio cue I use. See, uh, Jigglypuffs, <laughs> Jigglypuff mains, like to do this. Like to do this. <laughs> That's called a rising pound. I think it's the 12th frame of the move. On that 12th frame, the game checks your angle on your control stick. And based on that, it determines how high, or actually low, you can do a falling pound, uh, you go. And so, if you combine Jigglypuff's jumps and a rising pound on each, that gets you pretty close, but that's actually still not enough. You have to air dodge uh, vertically at the very end. So, we'll see if I can get this on the first try. Given that I just rolled accidentally, I'm not, I'm not feeling it, but we'll see. All right, here we go. Doesn't count. First try. First try, here it comes. My goodness, is my controller Okay, this this is weird. This this like never happens, and then suddenly it's happening all. How do you how do you restart a controller? Okay, we're back. So, start X and Y for three seconds. The controller should be good, and lo and behold, it looks like we are. So I'm gonna give it a shot. First try. First try. We got there! We got there! <laughs> okay, so for all of this stuff that you see over here, do I need to prove that? Do I need to prove that Jigglypuff can do all that? But we're actually going... We'll get to that in a second. Let's do the hard ones first. So this one in a box is tricky. Your character needs to have enough disjoint in order to hit through there. Samus! Go! Samus is the other one that can ball jump. <laughs> Oh, I feel so stupid. Shoutouts to Yuruzu for doing this with all kinds of characters. Well, he, he's done it for most with Fox, all but this stage. No, no, yeah, all but this stage. And with Samus can get through with down air, because Samus's down air has enough disjoint. I'm here. There we go. Samus's down air has so much disjoint that you can actually hit through, which is insane. But okay, enough about that. How does Jigglypuff get through? Well. You can't back air your way through it. I think it's safe to say you can't forward air your way through. Uh, your down air doesn't hit through, and obviously up air is not going to do it. So, let's use the most useful move 
that Jigglypuff has. Are you ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. Here we go. It works. Believe it or not, that crap works. Okay, so then... Now sadly, you can't fall through this platform, and this one, I am 99.99999% certain... There we go. Then I'm going to have to restart on this one a bunch. But let me give you the game plan. Basically, you have to try to get through those flippers and get, you know, into this little gap over on the right side. Characters can do that, but it's tricky. So I don't actually, I haven't tasked this before, so I don't know if it's possible to, say, <laughs> do it through there by just going straight in. But that hasn't been what I've found success doing. Uh, what I've found success doing is waiting for them to stop, because I think that actually does matter. Okay, you see what I'm trying to do here? Whoa! How did I miss that? Not paying attention, that's out. Okay. Well, once you... Oh! Second try! Okay, there we go. See, it's not that hard when your, your controller actually works. Okay, here we are. Okay. Yeah, that actually... Jigglypuff's drift is so insane, you can actually catch, even if you air dodge. I wonder if it would be useful to turn on hurt boxes so that you can see a little bit better. Oh! Ah, so close. Hey! We got there! We got there! Okay, so I think I, I must have been going a little bit uh, low all those other times. You go a little higher than you think you do. Um, yeah, so there's that. All right, just let me try that again. There we go, okay. So we got there again. So you do go a little bit higher than you think you have to. So just be warned if you're going to try this, be warned. And there we go. So that's, Jiggly, that's Jigglypuff doing Young Link. And from there it gets really easy. Um, I don't think that there are any other stages that would even pose a reasonable challenge to pretty much any other character, let alone Jigglypuff. So, given that, I'm just going to start putting some proofs. These proofs are not ta these are definitely not tasked, you will know. Uh, but just, just for verification's sake, alright, so this is, I guess, just the filler because, well, it's supposed to be the case that you can uh, access them on the character select screen. I have not been able to get that to work uh, for whatever reason. So I'm actually having to go into the debug menu every time and get that switched out. So here's Mario. No need to do anything too fancy there. Jab it. And there you go. Okay, there's a reasonable one, I guess. Ready, you know, I actually kind of forgot what some of these stages even look like. like I, I confess, I'm probably at some point going to have to look at the... Ooh, at the screen. Let's see. Oh, there you are. There we go. Not great. Ready, 
Nailed it. There we are. Thank you, 45 jumps. Yumps. This is super TAS optimal, kids. Okay. Please, please, somebody task this. That's hurting me. All right, Falco's turn. Rock me Amadeus. <laughs> there we go. If at first you don't succeed, go back to those 2002 strats. Oh. I guess that works. Hey! Gotcha! <laughs> Jigglypuff OP. <laughs> Please nerf. Alright, the year is 20XX. Everyone plays Fox Target Test. Poorly. Which is the opposite of 20XX. Ice Climber, so post age. Trying not to break any of the blocks. Hey, okay. There we go. <laughs> so Bowser's is pretty nifty, I think. I love how a bunch of characters get this, not this exact, but like an architectural style. Like a, I don't know, it reminds me of Olympus, maybe? Just a random thing to note. Maybe that's just me. Oh, missed one. Ah, there you are, buddy. Like, for example, I'm about to play Link Stage. Look, it has that same sort of feel to it. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, are you kidding me? Well, <laughs> rip. There we go. Okay. Okay, now that I think about it, actually Luigi's is my favorite. Look at this! <laughs> what does this even mean? Get over! Ah, uh, whatever. Going for that perfect. Going, yay, we got there! <laughs> Doing some Toho level shenanigans. <laughs> I think that there's a more optimal way. Pretty sure. Well, there we are. <laughs> Pancake. Jealous to Prince Abu. Alright, Mewtwo. Oh, get back 
back here! <laughs> Okay. Nailed it. There we go. Way up here. You know. Yeah, there we go. Ness's stage is okay. Okay. Oh. I had a moment. There is something up here, right? Oh. There we go. Okay. So, I didn't realize until just recently that people can have really strong opinions on which peach is the best peach. Like, I'm a Daisy fan, and apparently that... There we go. That means that I just lost, what, about a fifth of you who are in team everything else? Oh my god. Four, five, six, hey, there we go. <laughs> we got there. I'm gonna leave that one in, actually. Alright. There we go. <laughs> Jigglypuff Professional can count to six. You know, casually, Peach use has been the hardest one for me. In fact, we're just gonna start off with this. There we go, okay. So now that that's out of the way, There we go. Get over here! Pikachus, I actually don't remember what Pikachus looks like. So we may have to play a little hunt and seek, a hide and seek. One of those. As we miss our L cancels, like a scrub. Oh, there you are. Hey! Man, I don't know if I can do this one. Ready? Go! <laughs> Man, it's, it's just, it's so brutal. Ah, <laughs> oh, man, I don't know how I got there. So, I don't think I remember Samus's either. So, this will be fun. Ready? Go. Oh, what? Did I just... Oh, I don't think I needed to air dodge there, but better safe than sorry and all, I guess. Alright. Oh, crap. There you are. And there we go. Ta da! So it has the Sheik option on here, which I love. I, I do actually remember what Sheik's is like. It's brutal, man. Oh, how did I do that? How did I make it? I think I remember what Yoshi's like. Where all of them? Are. I don't have a clue where they where some of them are. I think... Let's see... Oh, there you are! <coughs> hey, buddy! And well, there we go. Alright, Zeldas. Let's see... Oh! That's right! I remember seeing Armada's, uh... Zelda one. It, uh... 
Kind of blew my mind how quickly he did that. Yep. Yeah. Is that the uh, optimal way to do that? No. Heck no. Whee! So Mr. Gaming watches. I have no idea. Watch me fumble about trying to smack these things. You get back here! Okay. And then I think that just leaves... Hey, there we go. Old school. I love it. Time for our boy to start putting in some work. Ready? Go! Wait a minute, can you back air through? Yeah, okay, so you don't have to. You can just back air your way in on those. Thank goodness. Frame nine. Frame nine, boys. All right, last one, which is good because we are about out of light. I'm getting darker and darker. Yeah. Hey! Hey! I don't care how horribly this one looks, I'm leaving it in. Oh, come on! Okay, okay. Where are you? <laughs> okay. Hey! No! <laughs> okay, we got there. It took forever, but there you go. Every target test stage done with Jigglypuff. So, I hope you've all enjoyed it. Send this to a tasser, you know. I'm looking at you, Yuruzu. You did the Samus and Fox ones. Please task the heck out of this. Uh, also, I will show you how to do it with Sheik and Zelda as well. That, that one's a little less pure for a number of reasons. One, uh, you have to use Sheik and Zelda in order to make it work, because Sheik wall jumps to get you out of Young Link's well, and Zelda hits the final target on uh, Jigglypuff stage. There's also one other itty bitty teeny tiny little catch, which may or may not be true because I haven't tasked this, but at least in human attempts, I've never been able to get Zelda to hit the last one without her dying in the process. She falls off the black falls into the bottom blast zone, and then the side B, the Den's fire, goes off and pops it. Uh, but maybe as a task you can find a window if you get everything just perfect. Anyway, that's it. Take care, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.